Tell us about America's hidden history. Sure. So uh, what we did for for season one is we took seven major holidays in America because, unfortunately, most Americans don't even know why we have some of these major holidays. For example, Fourth of July. Most Americans, unfortunately, don't even know what the Fourth of July is about. The fact that we separated from Great Britain, we declared our independence, or the people involved in that. And so what we do is we take some of those major holidays and we highlight some of the founding fathers who were a part of those major holidays. And, and we tell some of their story. We give details on the holiday. And, and in all of this, we highlight a lot of the Christian heritage that played a part in leading to that holiday. So whether it be 4th of July or Constitution Day or President's Day or uh, Black right. History Month, right, is, is February. But we have a, one episode on Black History Month highlighting so many of the black heroes that today Americans just simply don't know their stories anymore. And so we, for for seven episodes, we go through and really just help recapture some of the story, things that that we can celebrate some of America's past. In the midst of, we've we've mentioned several times, cancel culture. In the midst of cancel culture, there are people who are literally trying to cancel America because they say America has a lot of fundamental flaws. America is evil. America is bad. And what they're doing is they're taking very specific moments from American history, and they're using that to tarnish all of America. But as as actually a really interesting speech from Senator Tim Scott earlier this year, I think maybe a month ago now, he, after President Joe Biden gave his speech, came out and, and he gave his speech. And in his speech, he had an, this really incredible line that he pointed out that America's original sin is not what defines her, because just like as a Christian we believe, and it's true in America, America is the story of redemption. And and this is part of where when you study our past, of course, America's had moments where she made terrible decisions. We had leaders who made some pretty terrible decisions, pretty evil decisions at times. But in the midst of that, I would point out, you can pick any atrocity in American history. And literally, you can pick any atrocity. And if you simply ask the question, how did that atrocity come to an end? What you will find without exception every single time, those atrocities came to an end because Christians, pastors, churches stood up and fought against those things saying this has to end, and they led to that change in America. And many times, America changed those things before anybody else in the world changed those things. So America truly is a story of redemption. And so going through these these seven major holidays, we tell some of the stories of the really great steps America took along the way to help bring more freedom to people, to to help improve people's lives, to help America become a better nation. And it's stories that simply most people don't know. So it is a very fun way to go back and learn about American history, about the people, the heroes involved, the stories involved in helping America become the nation she became.